Hey guys, it's me, Drew, and I'm here to do a Bath and Body Works haul. Um, this is a collective haul, obviously, you'll tell from the video. Um, I bought a lot of candles because they were two for 25, and I bought six. Then I found out, like, a week or two later, they were two for 22, and I bought even more. So, then mason jars were on sale, and I bought those. Then hand soaps, the new hand soaps came out. Then I bought those. So, yeah, I have a big video to do. So, um, like I said with my Party Light haul, um, I'm not going to review every single candle because there's just too much. The first thing I will start off with is an eBay purchase. I remember these from Bath & Body Works from a couple years ago, maybe like five years ago. And they were always at my store and... And this was when I had the older wooden store before they um, remodeled and removed to a new location. Um, and, well, I never really bought them. And then once they were gone, I really missed them. So I finally found one for a great price. And here it is. This is a Slatkin & Company Pineapple Mango 3-Wick Candle. But it's not just a 3-Wick Candle. It is a jumbo three wick candle. This is the size of a normal three wick. This is the size of the jumbo three wicks. Now comparing now, this candle was twenty four fifty. The new candles are twenty two fifty. Mm, they still smell the same. This pineapple mango burns for 25 to 45 hours. <coughs> this candle burns for 65 to 80 hours. This burns a long time. Not that I probably will be burning it. It's just really cool to have such a memory candle in my collection that I remember burning. I remember I used to buy them, you know, burn through them, whatever. They were great. And now I have one in my collection that I can show people that I think is really, really cool. So, anyway, this is my Bath & Body Works haul. I will start off with body stuff. I bought the Fresh Picked Hand & Body Cream Hard Working in Market Peach. <coughs> now, I'm trying to stay away from their body care because I have so much body care from everywhere. I'm trying to stay away from everywhere, but especially Bath & Body Works because it's not the best quality. But... I love Market Peach, and now it's in body care form, so I did buy it. As well as me getting the Market Peach Mason Jar Soap. I think this is adorable. As well as getting the new hand soap, Market Peach Deep Cleansing, and Market Peach Gentle Foaming. I talked about the new soaps in another video. This one is Mango Hibiscus. Now, I did the 7 for whatever, 24, 8 for uh, whatever the new deal is. I did that, and then I had some coupons that came in the mail for a free hand soap, so I got 9 of them. Honolulu Sun. Apple Mango, which is a new scent in their permanent line, which is an amazing scent. Garden Strawberries. Peach Bellini. Black Cherry Merlot, one of my favorites, and my new favorite, Island White Pineapple. It smells so good. It's just the best pineapple scent ever. Ooh, I also bought that in a hand cream, but I forgot to grab it, so yeah. Next, I will talk about my Mason Jar Candles. Mason Jar Candles were on sale $7 each, and I bought 5 for 35 used my 10 off and got 5 for 25 so $5 a piece. Pink Passion Fruit. And I actually burned this yesterday. Burned nice and clean down the middle. I finished a three wick, which I'll show you in a middle in a minute. So I'm starting to burn this now. It smells super, super, super good. I'm not gonna go through every sun description because there's just too many. I got a honeysuckle bouquet. Just a nice fresh honeysuckle scent. Pink lemonade pound cake. I got these two scents because they're not available in three-wick form. Lemon drops. So I wanted to have them. I just didn't. They didn't make them in three-wicks. And another amazing scent, which I wish I got in a three-wick, but next time. Pomelo grapefruit. <coughs> so 
so those were the five mason jars I bought. And then for three wicks, I picked up a pineapple mango. This is from, like, the standard summer scent collection. A peach bellini. I love the packaging this year because it's so big and bold and just really, really great. And I have not had any problems with these new three wicks at all. Coconut leaves, which is actually the candle that I'm burning in my living room right now. But I'm burning the older version, so trying to get rid of that. Not getting rid of, but enjoying that until I finish it. And then a standard of mine, Island Margarita. So those were the four candles that I got in the um, summer collection. Then I will move on to the candle that I finished in the summer collection. I forgot. I finished Oceanside. I burned through this whole entire candle. It burned great. It's just like that wicks hang in there, but there's nothing left, and it gave a strong throw. It burned all the way down, just like all of my Bath & Body Works 3 wicks have been doing lately. It's just, they've been burning great. Then I got, I have two white barns. I have a random Japanese cherry blossom, just because I don't have this in any form in my collection. Spring. I love spring. It's just... It's just like, I don't even know how to describe it. It's just like a burst of fresh air. And then for the Destinations line, I got Tokyo Petals. And this is a scent that I've gone back and forth and back and forth on. Do I buy it? Do I not? I just bought it anyway. And there's the flowers. It's very light. It reminds me of the Japanese cherry blossom in a way, but it's good. And then Mahalo Maui, because I am not a Bath & Body Works insider, which really upsets me because... I buy a ton from Bath & Body Works, and, um, but Mahalo Maui, it smells so good, and look at how perfectly centered these wicks are on this candle, it's just perfect. Then I have four fresh picked, I have a peak passion fruit, I hope I'm not getting sick again, but it sounds like I am, market peach, because this is just my favorite. <laughs> the worst candle in the history of candles, but my manager challenged me to try it. Snap peas. It smells so bad. It smells dirty and just rotten and just oh, <coughs> bad. Then I got lemon mint leaf, which is so good. And then I have for sweet shops, not one of my favorite candles, or two of my favorite candles, or three of my favorite candles. This is my favorite. Cinnamon sugared donut. Oh, that was my chair. And um, cinnamon sugar donut, I actually have three more on their way. And I bought one whenever they first came out at full price. But, so I have seven of these now officially. It's just my favorite candle. I haven't even burned any yet. I still have one from two years ago. That's about halfway burned that I'm saving. Red Velvet Cupcake. They changed Red Velvet Cupcake this year. It's more chocolatey, and I like it even more than what it used to be. Strawberry Sorbet. And this is just a yummy, creamy strawberry scent. And lastly, Raspberry Peach Macaron. Which reminds me of the Sweet Macaron Candle, but a little bit better. That was my... Bath & Body Works haul. This bag's kind of deceiving because I just grabbed it out of my closet. But anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed this Bath & Body Works haul. Don't forget to comment, rate, and subscribe. And I'm almost at 6,000 subscribers. I'm so excited. There definitely will be a big giveaway for 6,000 subscribers. So tell your friends, tell your neighbors, tell your family to subscribe to my YouTube channel. And there will be a giveaway soon. I'll talk to you guys later. Bye.